This is a quick tutorial for the dissolve shader. I've gotten a few messages asking how you do something like this, so I'm just going to quickly show you. So in this scene, I just have a sphere and a cube. They're parented to a game object. <clears throat> I've thrown an animation on the game object. So the first thing you want to do is go into your animation, <clears throat> go into the mesh renderer, and then search for the dissolve alpha. Add that, and then throw your other mesh as well. Mesh renderer, dissolve alpha, add those. Now we want to just get our two materials and we want to set up the dissolve. So set it to point to point, and we're just going to go from negative one to one so that it looks like this. We're going to set the dissolve color to transparent. And that's that. So now you want to take one of the materials and make the start point the inversion of whatever your other one is. So we're going from negative one to one, and we're going to flip that and go from one to negative one. Now, set your dissolve alpha to zero on both. Go into your animation. So our dissolve alpha is zero on both. Now we're gonna go over here, we're gonna set the dissolve to one. And you can see that it's not quite working how you would want, but the issue is that you want one to go backwards and one to go forwards. So one of these is, is animating from zero to one and the other one's animating from one to zero. And you get that dissolve effect that goes from one into the other. Now I'll just duplicate this frame, put it over here, push play. and you're just going from one shape to the other. It's that easy. All right, thanks for watching.